Hello everyone, we will continue that topic. In the previous video, we covered up to context level and what we did, whatever the nodes required, we drag and dropped from the interface to our Adobe form. Now I will come on to this layout tab. Whenever you want to design the layout, you have to click on to layout tab. So if I will click on to layout tab, so one window will open where we can design our layout. Now you can see here we can design our layout. But many times people rather than clicking on to this button, they will prefer to click on to this button layout. What is the difference between these two things? If you click on to this layout tab, your full window, you, your layout will not be in the full window. But if you will click on to this button, it will be your full screen layout and maximum people are comfortable in seeing the full screen of the layout. If I will click on to this button, you can see our full window of the full screen layout window will open. I will just show you. I clicked on to that button and you can see full window is capturing that thing. Now, here we will cover few important parts and after that we'll start with the designing of the layout. You can see here we have few important things. I will firstly come on to hierarchy. What is hierarchy? Word itself is saying. Suppose whatever the layout elements you will design, all those things you will see here, all those layout elements you will be able to see in hierarchical order in hierarchy. Now, after that, I will come on to what is design view. Word itself is saying you will design the layout using design view. We have one more view present here. If I will click on to hierarchy, we have next is PDF structure. If I will go to next, we have one more view is present that is called as your data view. The word itself is saying that data of your PDF form will be available in that data view. So if I will come on to the important views available here, the first view is your hierarchy. If I will come on to hierarchy, in this view, you will see all your layout elements in the hierarchical order. Once we'll start with the designing, you can see all those layout elements will be available. In the design view, we will design our all layout elements and in the data view, data will be available. Now we will cover two important parts which are the base of our all, all PDF forms. So I will come on to concept of master page and body page. If you see, when we clicked on to layout button, we have one master page automatically present there or you can go through this master page button also tab also. So whenever you are clicking on to layout button, so we have one master page, at least one master page is automatically present there. I will read the theory and we will understand the full concept of master page. What master page is? What is master page? Every form design contains at least one master page that Adobe Lifecycle Designer creates automatically. If you remembered, 
when we started with that topic PDF forms, I told if you want to design the layout, we require Adobe Lifecycle Designer. So whenever you are clicking on to layout button, one master page is at least one master page is present there, which Adobe Lifecycle Designer creates automatically. See, we are not creating this master page. It's automatically present there. If you see, it's automatically present there. And Adobe Lifecycle Designer provides that page. Now the question comes, why, why there is a concept of master page? Master page is responsible for formatting body pages. After a few minutes, we will understand what body page is. The purpose of master page is to provide the design consistency. Suppose I'm saying I have thousand body pages which are coming in the output and all those thousand body pages, we want a common thing. So what we will do, we will go for that thing on master page and it will automatically appear on all the body pages because the purpose of master page is to provide the design consistency. They are used for responsible. They are responsible for formatting the body pages. Generally, suppose if every layout has a logo, if you want the logo on all the body pages, so best way, always you have to design the logo on the master page. So it will automatically appear on all the body pages. So this is the main, main benefit of your master page. Now, what is body page? Body pages are actually the pages of the form. Whatever the output you will see of your Adobe form or PDF form, all those are body pages. See, master page, whatever you will do, that thing will appear on all the body pages. But ultimately, your output of the PDF form is all your body pages. Every body page derives its page size and orientation from a master page. This is the most important point. But this point is saying every body page has his page and orientation from the master page. We'll see this point. If you see, we have a master page. We have a master page. And you can see we have this page. This page is will be your body page. This is your body page. If you see, we have this body page size. We have this body page size. How this size came automatically? It came from your master page. Suppose if I will click on to master page. I'm just decreasing the size of the master page. I'm just decreasing the size of the master page. Whenever you will decrease the size of the master page, the size of body page will automatically decrease. If I will go to your body page, you can see the size of the body page automatically decreased. That's why we are saying body page has nothing with body page, derives his size and orientation from the master page itself. If you will increase or decrease the size of master page, it will automatically reflect onto the body page. So we covered the most important significance because based upon that only, we can start with the designing of the layout. Master page is responsible for formatting the body pages. If whatever you will design on the master page, it will give the design consistency to all the body pages. And ultimately, what is body page? 
body page are the actual output of your PDF form. Whatever the pages you will see in the output, all those will be body pages. And the body page size and orientation is coming from your master page only. In the next video, we will start with the designing of the layout. Thank you.